practice question. A school minibus travels 640 kilometres. Taking one kilometre as equal to five-eighths of a mile, how many miles did the minibus travel? OK, so we've got 640 kilometres. One kilometre is five-eighths of a mile. So how many lots of five-eighths are in here will give us our calculation. So it's 640, divide that by 8, we'll get 8 64 by 8 times 0. 5 eighths we want, so we times by 5. 5 is 8, 5 is 40, 400. So our answer is 400 miles. Question 1. During a school trip to Germany, each pupil was allowed to exchange £100 into euros for spending money. The exchange rate was 1.06 euros to the pound. How many euros did each pupil receive? Right, this is a very simple one. You've got 100 pounds, you've got 1.06 euros to the pound, you're times 1.06 by 100, move your decimal point, you end up with 106, so our answer is 106 euros. Question 2. 90 pupils travelled to an exhibition on two coaches. Each coach cost £180 to hire. The total entrance fee to the exhibition for all pupils was £90. How much did each pupil have to pay to meet the total cost? OK, so we've got 90 pupils in total travelling on two coaches. That's our two coaches. Each coach costs 180 to hire each, so we must times that by two. We have 16, 3, 3, 6. We've got 360 for the coaches. Total entrance cost for the uh, for the exhibition was £90 for all the pupils. So we add the 90 to there. 5 and 4, so 450. And we've got 90 pupils, so we want 450 divided by 90. 9's into 9 go once, 9's into 45 go 5 times. So our answer is that each pupil had to pay £5. Question 3. A test is marked out of 60. Pupils need 75% to achieve a grade A. How many marks is this? Okay, so they need 60, they're marked out of 60, so our test is marked out of 60. We need 75% to pass. So, what is 75% of 60? Half of it will be 50%, should be 30. Half of 50% would be 25% would be 15, add together 45, so our answer is 45 marks. Question 4. The school library is open for 5 hours and 20 minutes per day on Monday, Wednesday and Friday, and for 6 hours and 30 minutes on Tuesday and Thursday. What is the total time the library is open during the school week? OK, it's basically a simple uh, multiplication. We want 5 hours 20 for 3 days, 6 hours 30 for 2 days. So, 5 hours on 3 days will give us 15 hours. We've got 20 minutes, 20, 40, 60, so that's another hour. Here we've got 6 hours on 2 days. So that'll be 12. We've got another half an hour on two days, which gives us another hour. So 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 1, 2, 29. So our answer is 29 hours. Question 5. A primary school concert cost £80 
for promotion, costumes and refreshments. The parents attending each paid a £1.50 entrance fee. 60 parents attended. How much money was left for the school funds? Give your answer in pounds. Okay, so the cost was 80 for the actual promotion, costumes and refreshments. We got 150 from each parent and there were 60 parents. So if they each paid a pound, we'd have got 60 pounds. If they each paid 50, we'd have got 30 pounds. So it's 90 pounds. Okay, so that's our income. How much was left for the school funds? We've got 90. Take away the 80 that it cost and that will give us 10 pounds. So our answer is 10 pounds. Question 6. A school sold copies of the class photograph to 28 pupils in the class for £2.50 each. What was the total amount raised from the sales of the photograph? OK, simple multiplication. We want 28 times £2.50. Easiest way, 28 times 2. OK, multiply it out. This is 16, this is 4, 5, 56. 28 times 50p. Obviously, 28 times a pound would be 28, times for 50p would be half that, so that would be 14. So, 0, 5, 6, 7, 70. So, our answer is 70 pounds. Question 7. What is 15% as a decimal? Okay, really simple one. 15% is 15 over 100. So we need, simply need to divide 15 by 100, our decimal point's there, divide it by 100, and we end up with 0 0.15, so our answer is 0 0.15. Question 8. In a year group of 45 pupils, 27 were boys. What fraction of the year group were girls? Give your answer in its lowest terms. Okay, so we want to know what fraction are girls. So 27 out of 45 are boys, so that means we have 18 out of 45 who are girls. Okay, uh, let's reduce that down. 9s into 18 go 2, 9s into there go 5. Can't reduce that any further, so our answer is 2 fifths. Question 9. A teacher plans a cross-country competition. The course is 3.45 kilometres long. The pupils do three laps of the course. What is the total distance run by each pupil in kilometres? All right, simple multiplication. We've got 3.45 and we times it by 3. So 5 threes are 15, 4 threes are 12, 13, 3 threes are 9, 10. Put our decimal point back in there so our answer is 10.35 kilometers question 10 there are 35 schools in a local authority 28 schools have been inspected in the last four years what percentage has not been inspected okay we don't need the four so 28 out of 35 have been inspected so we've got seven which haven't been inspected so seven out of 35 okay seven is there goes once seven is there goes five times so one fifth one fifth is 20 percent if you weren't sure how to work that one out you could have gone for the 100 times by the seven over the 35 in which case you still would have ended up with one there five there 100 divided by 5 would have given you 20, so again our answer is 20%. Question 11. A school play begins at 1900 hours. It has one interval of 15 minutes. The play is one hour and 55 minutes long. At what time does the play end? Give your answer using the 24 hour clock. Okay, simple just addition here. We've got 1900 hours. 
We need to add on 1 hour 55 for the actual play itself, so we'll be at 20.55. We've then got to add on the break as well. If we add on the 5 minutes, we'll be up to 2100 hours. Add on the other 10, we'll be up to 2110, and our answer is 2110. Question 12. 0 0.9 of a year group of 180 pupils took part in a school sports day. How many pupils did not take part? Okay, 0 0.9 is 90%. Uh, so 90% took part, so we know 10% didn't take part. 10% of 180 is, with decimal point, 18. So the answer is 18 pupils did not take part.